Good day. This is Peter Kniff from Castlestone Management with comments on the U.S. equity market for the week ending February 8th. The Dow Jones Industrial Average advanced 846.48 points, or 3%, to 29,102.51 last week, while the S&P 500 rose 3.2% to 3,327.71. The Nasdaq Composite gained 4% to 9,520.51, its biggest weekly gain since November 18th. All three hit record highs before profit taking hit the market on Friday. The concerns facing U.S. stocks remain the same, with the exception of President Trump's acquittal in his impeachment trial. So, why do stocks continue to advance? Investors have nowhere else to turn. Both Germany and China released weak economic numbers last week and the U.S. economy economic data continues to show steady growth. U.S. Treasury yields traded in line with stocks last week, rallying to start the week and slumping on Friday. The 10-year Treasury yield climbed 5.7 basis points last week, the 2-year rose 7 basis points, and the 30-year notched a 3 basis point advance. The dollar moved steadily higher over the week. As stocks rallied last week, gold saw some selling pressure, Gold prices were down 0.9% for the week. Oil prices have dropped 20% since peaking at 63.27 a barrel in January, as fears of a global economic slowdown brought on by the coronavirus continue to weigh on crude prices. Thank you for listening. Thank you for doing business with Castlestone, and we'll talk to you soon.